100 million betting transactions every weekend we have football. Football or any kind of sport. That's a huge ecosystem right there. If, you, if uh, private individuals or private institutions have designed products and digitized platforms that get, that have moved products like Rabajer, who pull a lot of that stuff into the digital format and it's now accessible by 100 million different transactions on a weekly basis. You can imagine what technology can do for capital markets, which is even more legit, more ideal, ideal in terms of an investment, uh, investment opportunity and investment outlook. This also gives insights to the risk appetite of the average Nigerian. We can leverage technology to capture this value while delivering a financial inclusion to the excluded. Three key steps, which I mentioned earlier, the how, how do we do it? We digitize, democratize, and deliver value. In digitizing, technology possesses the ability to transform process to become more efficient. We need to enumerate and identify and enumerate people and bring them into the ecosystem. We need to create products and solutions that fit each community and their region and, and the customer's needs. And then we need to ensure that the platforms are always available and are to teach us to value derived and must be clear and consistent for the unbanked to adopt these digital alternatives to their traditional systems. For me, it's exciting time for the capital market, it's exciting time for investment in Nigeria, and it's exciting time for the people in Nigeria, the capital market operators. Generally, technology, in closing, in closing, technology is just a tool. It's only just a tool. However, it relies on partnerships, innovation, collaboration between the various players for its potential to achieve financial inclusion to be fully realized. And I believe that after listening to all of this, everybody here should be very positive and expect that leveraging technology can begin to gradually help us close the gaps between those that are excluded but need investments and savings plans to what we actually have in right now. Let me just spend a minute about who we are and what some of the things we've done as an institution, e-transact on the front lines, how we have played as a top leader in driving financial inclusion. We've been at the forefront of financial inclusion for the past decade with the launch of uh, our partner's solutions, Pocket Money, which is still the foremost mobile money platform in Nigeria today. In 2019, we got the Central Bank of Nigeria Award as the biggest driver of mobile money transactions in the country. In uh, 2020, last year, we processed over 30 trillion naira in transaction value on the e-transaction chain platform. This year already, we've crossed over 45 trillion. Uh, yes, that's, that's a lot of number, but it's still very small in the grand scheme of things. Remember, I said we have 70 million Nigerians transacting every day, and those transactions don't go to any digital platform because they want to see their cash, they want to touch their cash, and they want to give their cash to trusted people. They don't trust banks, they don't trust any other person. But we need to come together, collaborate, and create products and equip and educate the people they trust within their communities to be able to identify, enumerate, and bring them into the digital world. As part of our pocket money scheme differentiators was our primary USSD banking, the visionary ones of our Star 39 hash USS district, which I talked about. And finally, as a super fintech in the industry, by virtue of our diverse set of capabilities, we are excited to be working with Kangan members to deploy technology to scale financial inclusion for the benefit of the capital market and the entire country in general. And uh, the last uh, slide here. Just pretty much our planes uh, on very high level, surface level, uh, track record. And uh, that is pretty much who we are at e Transact, and that's what we stand for. Uh, once again, I'm excited to have you here. I thank you for your attention. I appreciate uh, the attention and the, uh, uh, the, the way I paid attention to what I was saying. And uh, you know, we look forward to more collaboration and we look forward to other events 
with your partner we can come on. Thank you very much for listening. Will you please continue the applause? Continue the applause. Please say more than Twitter. It's challenging. It's highly innovative. It's for us. We are so determined to all of us to take this message to every Nigerian.